One of the most mysterious and celebrated women in history seems to be speaking to us again. It turns out that deeply private Jacqueline Kennedy had an unlikely confidant. She wrote in personal thoughts about ambition, the husband she loved, infidelity, the anguish of his death. ABC's David Wright has the secret thoughts of this woman we studied in all those pictures. She was, till her dying day, a public figure but also a very private soul. Never did Jacqueline Bouvier Kennedy reveal her true feelings, even when the whole country wept for her. But she bared her soul to an Irish priest she met only twice, Father Joseph Leonard, her pen pal of 14 years. Now dozens of her newly discovered letters are being auctioned off in Ireland. She was young, but far from naive about her husband, who was, as she puts it, consumed by ambition like Macbeth. He's like my father, she wrote, loves the chase and is bored with the conquest. And once married, needs proof he's still attractive, so he flirts with other women and resents you. But, she later confided, there was something in it for her. Maybe I'm just dazzled and picture myself in a glittering world of crowned heads and men of destiny, and not just a sad little housewife. Only years later, in an audio interview released by her daughter, did she discuss the strain of it all. I always thought there was one thing merciful about the White House, which made up for the goldfish bowl and the Secret Service and all that. After the assassination, she confessed to Father Leonard, I am so bitter against God, but added, only he and you and I know that. Now we all do. These letters, a treasure trove, but also a violation. David Wright, ABC News, Los Angeles.